Hello my fellow humans and welcome back to another daily dice where we ask the dice for message and find out what that is. Keeping in mind that these are general readings so please take what resonates and leave what does not knowing that as you interact with the channel by liking, commenting, and subscribing it does allow me an opportunity to directly connect with your energy and get you out more resonant readings. If you are interested in supporting the channel further, check out the description box down below where you will find the links necessary to email me for a personal reading. Um, I will get you out further information from there. And also you can follow me on over to my podcast at Scatter Love Radio, which is just a fun, chill hangout session with yours truly. And I do hope to see you over there. So with that being said, I will go ahead and start with this reading and let's find out what is today's daily dice we're going to do in regards to love today, Source. What is today's daily dice in regards to love? What would you like my fellow humans to know? What is today's daily dice in regards to love? Second house, Jupiter and Leo energy. So there could be a date coming on the horizon for you. Someone that wants to offer you some sense of stability it's going to make you feel good, though, that's for sure. This is something that's going to boost your confidence and feel very lucky, right? This is someone who's very passionate, very in touch with their inner child. This is someone who is very open and expressive and very exciting. <laughs> like sometimes, though, drama can follow them, but they're a very joyful person, very spirited this is someone who has very stable income for sure they're very centered in who they are this is someone who has a good work ethic they have good values they take care of their daily routines they like comfort and their self-care is a priority this is someone who is a leader they're very confident they're very proud they're very popular and fun, artistic and warm, very outgoing, someone that's very happy all the time, who's very optimistic, who has a ton of growth coming into their life, is very understanding, experiences a lot of luck, makes their own luck, is always growing their finances, who likes to travel or experience new, new things, new cultures, right? Has good honor, has good morals, is very generous and has a great humor has a great humor this is somebody who's really funny all right let's see what's going on here hearing that song i can see clearly now the rain is gone i can see all obstacles in my way can see clearly now the rain is gone it's gonna be a bright 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 sunshine and day like that's coming through so strong right now so like i feel like that's it it's like this is just a bright sunny day like this is someone who's gonna bring a lot of warmth into your life a lot of happiness like it's almost like this is what you've asked for Right? There's been a lot of positive feedback on the Daily Dice in regards to love here lately. So this is just kind of like a continuation. It's almost like if you're doubting that this person's coming, it's like Source is telling you, don't doubt. Like This is someone who's really coming in, and they're really a good energy. So they could be a Capricorn, someone who's ambitious, who's realistic, uh, takes methodical steps, takes their time with things. This is someone who's very stable and sturdy and secure. Okay, on the bottom of the deck, we have love endures. Love does not give up or lose faith. Love is hopeful and withstands every situation with number 43. Exactly what I was saying. Like they, they're saying, don't lose hope. <laughs> don't lose hope. This is somebody that's coming in. They are coming for you. It's going to be a surprise and it's going to be well worth it. Let's get... Okay, well, I would, did not want that many. I'll take that one but I don't want all these. That's too many. I want one more, though. Just one source. Just one more. Okay, Scarab Beetle. Magic works through you. Number 52, 7. So 7 is a very powerful number for you. All right, let me grab these. We'll get some of these messages. Let's see what we got going on here. 
house 10 structure discipline life mission accomplishments and career so this is coming because you're on your life mission like you're in your path of purpose okay this is also somebody who wants to come in being a parent a father a mother right like we have saturn energy feeling restricted expressing experiencing struggle learning hard work and patience right don't lose hope these are both connected to capricorn energy and we had capricorn on the bottom of the deck i don't think that has ever happened to me in the time that i have had this deck i'm gonna move these all over hold on let's just i just feel like those all should go together because that's intense that is all capricorn energy right there so you could be a capricorn or this person could be a capricorn but that is intense i don't think that's ever happened to me like that before on the same reading oh we have the only thing that is real is love shift your focus back to love with number seven this is incredible whoa the synchronicities are profound okay and we have be authentic be real and true to who you are and how you feel with number 39 okay yeah being authentic is here i feel like they're coming in because of your authentic energy like you're okay with who you are right you're okay with what you're doing like you've owned your journey and that's a part of what's bringing them in and this is like what you've gone through too this is something that you've experienced coming into your path of purpose you had to go through hard work you had to go through struggle and now you're taking slow steps towards your journey you're taking slow steps towards your your wealth in your life and this person is going to be a mirror to that we have number 22 look at these synchronicities 22 dragonfly spirit truth transcends illusion yeah you're illuminating you're illuminating the illusions and then we have number 60 with swan swans mate for life this is profound in the love reading we have time for a deep dive yeah so something is changing like we have two swans here a swan on her hat and a swan here yeah, this is inc this is incredible. This is someone who's going to be here for life. Let's get some oracles out on it. Some of the yin yang oracle source. What else would you like to say for this? North node cosmic purpose. Yes, I am in love with this reading. I love this energy for you. I love it. I am so excited for you. Oh my gosh, look chemistry and passion. Oof. Someone cool the jets. We have the North Node is the one card that flipped over here. Cosmic Purpose. I cannot make that up. You are in your North Node. And because of that, you're calling in your soulmate. This is the person who's meant to be with you on the journey. Yeah, but it's sometimes hard, right? Look, like Saturn energy. We have thoughts and isolating. Yeah, that's exactly what Saturn is. It's very isolating at times. It's a planet of tough love. Like these are things that we don't want to learn, but we have to learn. And so it gives us just a tough time in order to make us learn them. Right? The planet of sacrifice. We have to sacrifice our ego in order to learn our lessons. But you're making it through. You're becoming empowered. The strength is here. This is like illuminating the truth, right? Like the sun is shining through. So this could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy that's coming in. I know Pisces and, and uh, Capricorns get along really well. That's actually a good balance. Um, let's see here. Yeah, <laughs> balance. I just said balance, and we have balance coming through. Ah, I cannot right now. That's so incredible. We have karma and justice. This is the balancing of your karmic justice. This is it. You have balanced out that awful energy that maybe you've been experiencing for some time. This is like self-forgiveness. You may be getting an, like an apology from someone, but I do feel like overall there's just a ton of chemistry coming in here. Like this is someone who just sees you and is like, mm, that's my person. And the two of you are going to be thick as thieves. Okay. I know it's like a terrible expression, but that's what it feels like. Like ride or die, like true romance to its core like you're just going to be there for each other this is such a powerful reading i absolutely love this if you feel like this is your reading leave a swan emoji down below and say i walk in my north 
and just let source know you're calling in this higher vibrational love okay but this is what i see for you i'm gonna go ahead and leave it there and get on out of here leave me a thumbs up and i do want to take a quick second to thank your guides your spirit messengers your angel source and my spirit guides for coming together to give us this incredible message and until next time stay human bye